Okay, there's a magic move the pros are doing that I guarantee that you're not, and this is what it is. What they do is, in transition, their lead shoulder stays down and actually scribes a deeper, deeper turn on the way down than it does on the way back. So what, what's happening is they're actually pushing down into the ground, slightly increasing their forward bend, pushing their ribs down into the ground, etc. As they're moving that lead shoulder down, their lead arm works down their chest and across their chest really fast. So this is going down pretty slowly as the arms work down the chest really fast. And that gets the, everything synchronized, gets the plane shallow, gets the arms to relocate. You know, the arms from this point here, from the top of the swing to lead arm parallel, they go from like two miles an hour to 25 miles an hour. And then from lead arm parallel to lead arm here, it only increases another three or four miles an hour. So that part there is kind of a little magic move combined with the fact that the lead shoulder goes down further, down off the chin further than it did um, uh, on the way back. A lot of amateurs do this. They get to the top and their lead shoulder comes out of the shot and they spin out of the shot and pull the club out of position or the lead shoulder kind of just hovers on the chin and the arms are just really slow and get left behind. So work on really trying to get that lead shoulder down, get that arm down your chest, speed the arms up. Swing it more like a pro than amateur. It's gonna help so many things. That is a little magic move that not many people know about.